Can Chapter 7 Bankruptcy Stop Car Repossession? Chapter 7 Bankruptcy wipes out debts by repaying a portion through asset sale and writing off the remainder. Whether you can stop car repossession with Chapter 7 depends on the amount of the car loan, whether car payments are in arrears, and if any relevant bankruptcy exemptions are available. Filers cannot make up car loan arrears through a repayment plan in the Chapter 7. However, they may be able to make up the payments outside of the bankruptcy by working with the lender separately, which in turn can stop car repossession in its tracks. By reducing other debts, some Chapter 7 filers free up enough money to repay car loan arrears and then remain current with car loan payments. Those who are able to afford payments reaffirm car loans. When a car loan is reaffirmed, the individual signs a reaffirmation agreement with the lender committing to continue payments as if the bankruptcy had not been filed. In exchange, the lender permits the individual to keep the car. Redeeming the car is another option for a Chapter 7 filer who has come into a sum of money. Redemption is less common than reaffirmation because it requires the individual to pay a lump sum equivalent to the current value of the car. If the creditor accepts the proposed repayment, the individual must submit it within a specified period to stop car repossession. The legal standard for redemption value is the retail value of the vehicle. How can Chapter 13 bankruptcy stop car repossession? It is a bit easier to save your car with Chapter 13 bankruptcy because car loan arrears can be made up through the Chapter 13 repayment plan. Car owners who owe more than their cars are worth may be able to reduce their loan values to the replacement value of the vehicles. This process is called a cram down and is exclusive to Chapter 13. If the vehicle is leased, a Chapter 7 or Chapter 13 filer may assume or continue the lease and make payments through lease expiration. This involves agreeing to all terms of the initial lease, including damage and excess mileage charges. In rare Chapter 13 cases, the bankruptcy trustee assumes the lease, fulfilling the role of the vehicle owner.